This is a message to not go back. Do not go back. Do not go back. Many of you will not go back. You will not be able to go back to the way things were because they were, because it's it's not going to be the same. It's not the same. Um, we're definitely entering a different time and season. All right. Um, I had a dream. Um, and pretty much in a dream, your enemies think that the life or the calamity or whatever problems that you have, they think that they are the cause of it. Like they cause you to have this calamity and this, uh, this trouble in your life. Your enemies believe that. And so they're going to act sorrowful and be empathetic towards you in this season. But they don't know that God is the one who actually did it. Many think they did it. They think they witchcraft work. You know, they think they uh they hoodoo and they voodoo worked on you. Um, they're Santa the year. They think whatever you know this new age practices that they do. They think that it worked. That's why you so called going through what you're going through. But really, you're going through what you're going through, or you went through what you went through for the glory of God. But your enemies is going to be remorseful, like they're sorry for what they they think that they cause in your life. So they might come and try to give you a gift or try to, you know, uh, help you make it better. OK, this is what the gist of the dream was about. And a lot of these people are from your past. A lot of these things were, were things that you used to be associated with. OK, so in this season, do not go back. Do not go back. All right. Uh, the soul who sins shall die. So do not return to your vomit in this season. Um, I want to come from Ezekiel chapter 18. And I'm just going to read a little bit. I'm going to read verses 1 through 4. It says, the word of the Lord came to me. What do you mean by repeating this proverb concerning the land of Israel? The fathers have eaten sour grapes and the children's teeth are set on edge. As I live, declares the Lord God, this proverb shall no more be used by you in Israel. Behold, all souls are mine. The soul of the father as well as the soul of the son is mine. The soul who sins shall die. The soul who sins shall die. So do not sin in this season. Do not return to your vomit. Be blessed.